time was nine o'clock. I was at the store. I didn't even realize he noticed me when I heard a knock at the door. By this time, it was after 9.30. It was our first date. I was nervous. It wasn't even 12 yet. I just got off at the North Avenue stop. It was almost 10.30. The bus stop. That's where it happened. I was waiting for the bus. It was a quarter to one. It happened so fast. His hand was over my mouth. He held me tightly, my back to his chest. And he grabbed under my jacket, then. He leaned over to kiss me. I couldn't react before he struck me over the head and I fell. I, I was on my hands and knees struggling to get up, but he held me down while his warm breath was staining my neck. He was ripping at my clothes. He told me I was beautiful. I can't remember what exactly happened next. It was our first day. We were in his car. Beneath the old tracks. In the hole. In the abandoned building. I was begging them to stop. Shut the fuck up, bitch! I'm gonna teach you a lesson, you little goof bitch! They raped me over and over. He shot himself into me. I never I saw him. Head. Nothing. It was our first date. He told me I was beautiful. I never got a good look at his face. I was looking right at his face. He was wearing a long coat, jeans, blue baseball. I don't know. Between six foot and six two. Weight approximately 150. 180. 200 pounds. pounds. He was my ex. Boyfriend. He was a dark complexion. Like. Brown hair, no black eyes, brown, no green jacket. I, 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 I've been. These were the only words I could say. But I, I've been raped. How could this happen? No evidence. No evidence. No suspect. Unable to pursue a trial. Unable to pursue case. Never tried. Case pending. I was raped one year ago. I am still waiting. I was raped one year ago. I am still waiting. Case pending. Never tried. Case unable to pursue. Trial unable to pursue. Suspect. No evidence. No eyewitnesses. How did this happen? But I've been raped. raped! These were the only words I could say. I've been raped. raped. I. I. Jacket. No. Green. Eyes brown. No. Black. Brown hair. Light. Complexion. Dark. He was a boyfriend. He was my ex. 200 pounds. 180 pounds. Weight approximately 150? 62? Between six foot and I eight. don't know! Blue baseball cap. Jeans. A long coat. He was wearing. I was looking right at his face. I never got a good look at his face. It was our first date. He told me I was beautiful. I had almost nothing. No one could hear me. No one could me. Bitch! No one could help me. It was too No one No one was there. I must have fainted. He shoved himself into me. I never saw him. Then all I remember is fucking dying. They raped me over. Shut the fuck up, bitch. I'm going to teach you a lesson, you little I was bitch. begging him to stop. In the abandoned building. In the hallway. Beneath the L tracks. It was our first day. We were in his car. I can't remember what exactly happened next. I thought you loved me. He told me I was beautiful. He was ripping at my clothes. The warm red was saving my neck. Down I was on my hands and knees struggling to get up, but I couldn't even react before he struck me over the head and I fell. He leaned over to kiss me. He grabbed onto my jacket, though. His hand was over my mouth. He held me tightly, my back to his chest. It happened so fast. It was a quarter to one. The bus stop. That's where it happened. I was waiting for the bus. It was almost 10.30. I just got off at the North Avenue stop. It wasn't even 12 yet. It was our first day. I was nervous. By this time, it was after 9.30 when I heard a knock at the door. I didn't even realize he noticed me. I was at the store. The 
time was 9 o'clock. <laughs>